New Jersey congressman and member of the Homeland Security Committee, Jeff Van Dyke, uh, Jeff Van Drew, to get his take. I want to ask you real quick, in light of all this Christmas stuff, we're all having a great time. We're all getting the things that we think we need. The White House is saying that President Biden saved Christmas. Poll numbers might not agree, sir, right? They definitely don't agree. First of all, let me say Merry Christmas to everybody. It is a wonderful time of year. Secondly, I'll be honest with you, I love Christmas, favorite holiday, but this is the big Biden Christmas lie. Uh, he's just not telling it straight. I mean, if he wants to tell it straight, he ought to speak about how our cities across the country have the highest crime rate that they've ever had. He could talk about the fact that we have a supply chain problems that still exist and in many cases have gotten worse. He could talk about the fact how our border is broken open and literally we have people bleeding into the country who are sick, who are some of them diseased, some of them are criminals. He could talk about the fact that we used to have the best energy portfolio under uh, the president obviously before President Trump, and now that we don't anymore. He could talk about the fact that we got the Abraham Accords done under President Trump last year, which was an amazing piece mm -hmm. of history for the Mideast. I can go on and on. Right. So you know what I think he should do, just to be honest with you? I think this Christmas he should promise make a Christmas pro promise to get a cognitive test on how he's doing and maybe make a Christmas pro promise that he's going to resign soon. This is the worst presidency <laughs> and the worst majority of Congress in history. And I'm telling it how it is. So